Hey guys, today I'm gonna um teach um help you how to do figure figurative language study island fifth grade common ELA common core. So most of you guys already know my strategy and it's pretty much like crossing out the answers that you don't know. And as you can see I did pretty much terrible on this um yeah but I know how to do it better now so let's read the question first and I'm gonna read it now, so I'm gonna it. um what does the underlying phrase most likely mean um Avoto felt a little sad when he lost his ball when he decided it is not no use crying over spilled milk so that's pretty much another saying of that pretty much saying that you can't you can't be sad over something that you can't fix again like you can't that already happened so it's useless to feel sad about something you cannot change that sounds pretty pretty good okay Ooh. it is the it is best to always remember things that make you sad. No, it isn't. So, let's put that in that. So, turquoise is right, and, and, um, and mag, mag, magenta is wrong, okay? So, C is, it is best to always store, store your milk in safe place. No. Okay, because you already know that doesn't mean, that doesn't make any sense, so we might as well know that that's wrong. It is useless to try to clean up milk after you spill it. That doesn't, that doesn't do anything with the underlying sentence. Just, just means A, so let's click on that. Yeah, one out of one. You can always use explanation again. Um, unregistered hyper, hyper cam might be there. Oh no. So you can always read the read the explanation if you don't know. Which of the following sentences contains a simile? Um a simile is pretty much um a sentence that says like or as in it pretty much. It's like yeah, a word that's a sentence that says like or as in it. So I don't think you have to read the whole paragraph to know what can, which ones can so my so A doesn't say like or as in it so let's cross this out and Victor walked off the field as right here see proud as a peacock so it has two as is which is even better so that could be the right answer coach Adams knew Victor was a great football player but he didn't think Victor was ready to play that doesn't say like a rise in it finally during a Friday night game Victor was unexpectedly called up to play that does that doesn't say like a rise in it so let's click on B yeah um you can always do some, um, you can always do explanation if you didn't get it. So, next question is a metaphor. A metaphor was like, can't really explain it. You can, you can search it on Google, like the definition of metaphor. You could even do that right now. Because I can't really explain it. What is the definition of metaphor? Yes. No. Okay. Um. We don't. I don't know. Let's go this way. Okay. 
Okay. A figure of speech in which a word or phrase that ordinarily dis discates one thing that is doesn't uh, other customers. I see your troubles. Okay. So, after seeing that, we can look at back here. Mm. He scored such one for the team. Um. I think that's wrong. I think this is wrong too. I think this is right. Could be wrong. And D is wrong too. I think C is right. Yeah. Explanation. I can read it. Metaphor compares to. Two. Oh, a metaphor compares to. Compares two different things. So. Metaphors do not use words like res. See, this doesn't have like res in it. The phrase Victor was a rock star is a metaphor. Although Victor is not a singer, that compares how popular Victor is at the end of the story. So, popular rock star is. Everyone is cheering for him, giving him high, high fives. So, one thing we know about metaphors are that they don't have like res in it. But we know that these other ones don't too, so. To reread it, Victor was rock star is a metaphor. It's just, it's just pretty much saying that uh, he was something. He's like, like Ben was as fast as a cheetah. That could be a metaphor too. I don't know. That's just something. Um, you could describe someone who describe someone that. He's like, cause Victor high fives and stuff. So let's bring this right here. What is the meaning of the phrase "the lake was a sheet of wash glass"? But one, once again, you don't have to read the paragraph always to just get this. So let's just read this. The lake was a sheet of wash glass. The lake was calm. The lake was frozen solid. Those could be B and D are most likely the answers. Sheet of balls. Could be B or D. I don't know. Let's get B. No. It's D. Metaphor compares two different things without using any words like or as a metaphor. Homes like was. Yeah. Simile. Oh, yeah. Similes are easier than metaphors. This A isn't because it doesn't have like grass in it. Charlene, yeah, it doesn't have like grass in it. This one has as right here and here. So it's to C. Yeah. Like grass, using words like grass. Yeah. Let's go to the next question. Um. She wrote the baseball hat. fishing reel to a baseball hat. Okay guys, I'm gonna stop right here because I did half of it. So um if you don't still if you still don't get this you can actually do it yourself and um you can actually try and do it but it could be hard for you. So um subscribe, write and comment. Um um that's pretty much it so